Welcome back everybody. Thank you for watching another video. So we got a really interesting video for you tonight. We're going to be having a look at the first plant-based all-purpose COP gun cleaner I've ever seen. And it's by Professor Pugh. And as always, guys, if at the ending of the video you want to purchase this awesome gun cleaner and help support the channel, make sure you check out the link in the description below because we do get a small commission when you purchase this item. And of course, before getting started, just want to thank the good folks out at Bravo Belt for sending me Professor Pew to check out. Let's get started. All right, guys, here we go. Professor Pew is a CLP, clean, lubricate, and protect. And what that means to you is not only can you use it to clean out your firearm, your barrel, your slides, and all those other things, but... You can also use it to lubricate things like pivot points on knives and those special areas on your firearm. And you can use it as a protectant to stop things from rusting like high carbon steel. It's basically good on all finishes. It cleans out all this stuff here. And don't forget to follow the directions on the back of the bottle. You want to make sure that you soak the pieces for at least two to five minutes. And please read these precautions before starting. All right, let's take some before videos. You can see a lot of fouling right here on the ramp. And in the lug area, pretty dirty. And I'm going to shine a light right down on this mat so we can see through the barrel. Not very shiny at all, right? You can see it's pretty dirty and there are a lot of fouling. So hopefully we can clean that up, make it shiny, and clean out all this fouling here on the ramp. All right, here is your after shot here. We can see the ramp area is a lot shinier, a lot cleaner. And that's just after the first cleaning there. You can see right around the lug area too, clean a lot of that falling in there. And let me bring the light back in, shine it back down. You can see the barrel is a lot slicker looking, a lot shinier. So that's not too bad for a first cleaning. Let's move on. Of course, there's a lot of falling on slides right down in this general area. We can see how dirty that is there. So we'll try to clean all of this up here inside of the rails. And there's always a lot of falling right down in here. So we'll try to clean all this up. All right, here is your after shot of the bottom of the slide. We can see how shiny this area is here right now. And all that crud in the rails. Nice and clean. And again, all I did was soak it two to five minutes, wiped it down with some paper towels. And that's a really nice first clean. And look how filthy the frame is. I'm going to see if we can clean up this area in here. And down in this area. We can see there's a lot of evidence of falling in there. Check out the difference here. You can actually see the number stamped into the part here. So 204017. All right, how clean this area is now here too. Yeah, it does a great job. All right, the last thing I want to test is just how well Professor Pew cleans lead. Now, I know this isn't exactly what goes on in a barrel, but I got a little bit of lead that I've been scratching on this piece of sheet metal, and I just want to see how much lead we can take off of it. All right, you can kind of see the infected area right here after I sprayed it and got a clean paper towel. Let's see what happens here. Yeah, it looks like it's cleaning it off pretty good. Oh, yep, that's all the lead. Nice. There's a look at that. Once again, guys, this has been Professor Pew from the beautiful people out at Bravo Belts. If you're looking for a new gun cleaning solution that's less harsh, plant-based, soybean to be precise, still cleans really good, and you can clean, lubricate, and protect, this might be a great option for you. Well, all right, guys, this is the ending of the video. Remember, if you want to purchase Professor Pew, make sure you check out the link in the description below. Thank you for watching. I'll catch you in the next video. Music